because you are being left out. And me, who is the leader of Linda Jami, we stand for those who have been left out. Wakina Mama are left out. The Jana are left out. There are some tribes that are left out. How can we be part of the new revolution that will take Kenya Mbele? Lakini usikuja revolution ya siyasa ya ukabila. We will never accept siyasa ya ukabila. Let's be united. And if we are united against the purpose, we will work. Na strike kusikia wewe wana pigana na mimi na ukwena na wewe. Kwa sababu, we need to come together to take our country forward. If you are fighting me, me I'm not Ruto, me I'm not his setup. If you are fighting him, he's not the problem. The, the, if your poverty, the problems about unemployment, I'm not the one creating them. It is them. Our common enemy is one William Ruto. That's the enemy. Don't fight anybody else. In fact, let me tell you for sure, we are going to amend Article 1 of the Constitution where we need to recall the President and Deputy President directly, not through Parliament. Secondly, we need to call all members of Parliament, also in total directly. To Kifanya here, you'll find a way to change your country, and thank you very much. Yes. I'll give you a name. But I was. Mr. Bank, what I do, what of the what I want to do, what 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 cannot take us anywhere. If it can take you anywhere, we will let and see 2027. That is my main point. I'm advising you as Google and Aichi. Second thing I want to say, let us be organized. There should be a way on which we can deal with each other. I know you are very senior, Okanga, but you know respect is given to the people you meet. Uh, you cannot treat us like stones uh, just because you are a speaker. Uh, you cannot do anything. Uh, the boss, no, those things are in the in fact, I'm talking and you're talking again. You can tell the Lord who is not a No, we are just talking. Mr. Speaker, do you have a question? These are murders, these are murders. What if Bunga is not organized? How do we go anywhere? We must have a way to organize. And you're the Yes. Okanga cannot understand. End of the story, my brother. My mother is this way. My mother is this way. Me, I like talking about national issues, issues of national interest at the moment. What is hurting at national interest now? I'm sure some of you too saw me taking petition to commission for the decision of justice on Woodsman because this country has been captured. The country has been captured because the question as to who rules Kenya. Do you have an answer who rules Kenya? The person who rules Kenya is a political capitalist. Who is a political capitalist? Someone who uses politics to capture the economy and drive it for self-interest. Like now, each citizen belongs to William Ruto 100%. He has captured Safaricom. Even the chair of Safaricom board is Ruto's personal lawyer. He has reshuffled the whole board. He has plucked all professionals from different boards in Parastatos and replaced them with the people who are serving Ruto Enterprise. It's, it's really a very me. sad thing. It's, really it's a very sad thing. Plucking professionals. Ruto wants us to rule, want to rule us with politicians. Remember, Wakati Wakibaki, Kulikwanga na technocrats in government. The technocrats were around 92%. Uhuru brought it to 88%. Now Ruto has, you mentioned all my commissions, you mentioned Moses, uh, Moses Puri. You talk about the one who has brought the fertilizer and the uh, linturi. Those people are political capitalists who have come to destroy our country. Linturi does not even know a formula of a, of a fertilizer. So what I'm trying to say in, sh in short here, we are having a captured state. Now you as young people, all of us, what shall we do? The main strategy is that we should shake this system, take Kenya back to Kenyans, because Kenya is not with Kenya. 
And the state capture here also means World Bank, IMF is one writing for you, your budget. Like, do you know the fertilizer issue is, is, is not as shallow as you see it? By them bringing fertilizer, which is 100% chemical, because fertilizer should be 70% organic. Wakiaka kwa udongo, hautawai kuchukua mimea hapo. You will never have anything there. So that they continue importing for you GMO, they continue importing for you food from another country, and keep you as slaves, you can't produce. If we want to cry people from Mungoma, if you want to cry people from Kakamega, because fertilizer went there, isn't it? People of Rift Valley, who brought this government to, to power, your son is being da damaged permanently. A chemical change is not a biological change. A chemical change is permanent. The pH levels of those cells have gone so high, you'll never reap anything. This government is a government of what we call in Doluo, Mibiero. Mudiero and Bier. Mudiero, Gudier. That's what they are bringing. Mudiero, Gudier. Mudiero, Gudier. Manana Maginge. They don't know anything else. So they are bringing poverty in this country. And as I look at my fellow young people here, I can see we are being driven straight to poverty. And if we are not careful, we are fighting ourselves. Why? Who is Wetangula? Wetangula is a Kenyan, like as we love it. Uh, Natembe are the same. Nobody the same. But do we agree with their policies? That is where I am I'm, I'm looking at the question, for example. When Eugene Mamala was Minister for Water, I let her Those are the questions you should be asking. What is Natembea doing now in as a governor? You can see there's some things he's doing there which he's doing right, isn't it? Moses Wetangula in Parliament as a speaker. Tell me anything. They said they didn't even read the Finance Act. As a, 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 a speaker sitting in Bunge, you cannot guide your MPs to read Finance Act to know it is wrong. Bills are passing in Parliament within two hours, debated by 300 MPs. Is that leadership? Are, are you getting my point? If we come to Musalia Mdavis, I don't even know what he stands for. I only know he says that he is in UDA. Kwa hivyo mi nigetaka kusema hivi, let us look for leaders with purpose. When I'm finishing, there's a volcano taking place in different parts of Kenya. The one in Western Kenya is just beginning. ODM is also going to face the volcano until it becomes a complete shell. When Joho and Opalanya are starting over ODM, the ODM they'll be leading will be a very different ODM. Itaka kama gunda. Gunda ina maisha penye watu wa mehama. Watakuwa na lead ODM ila mba watu wa mehama. So, as young people, Instead of looking at me, 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 me